celebration of food, family, and tradition. In this segment, sponsored by the Newport News Greek Festival Marketing Liaison, Greg Bicaveras joins us now with more. Now, I have to say, uh, I know this man very well. Normally, we're busy chatting about sports. Uh, he was actually busy this weekend. You did, a, you did another NFL game, didn't you? Sure, worked a game for an uh, opposing network, we'll yeah. say. <laughs> we'll just keep it at that. Normally, work for Fox, but uh, it's a lot of fun. But as always... Uh, something going on in Washington, as you know. Well, and especially there's always something going on in Hampton Roads, and especially coming up, we have the Greek Festival. So tell us uh, what can what can folks in Hampton Roads most look forward to? Well, thank you so much. Uh, this is going to be our fall edition, which is going to be like an indoor event, open to everybody, free admission, free parking, and it's going to be Thursday through Saturday. Greek food, desserts, beverages, could be a lot of fun. How how do you generally what do you, what do you want people most to know about this, and how you know you t you touched a little bit on it. What can people, how can they get over there, and how can they enjoy it best? Well, it's all inclusive. This is all about the people. We want people to come and say, look, we're kind of trying to get back to normal. There's a lot of events that have been canceled, as you know. But this is going to be something that, uh, that people can enjoy, a nice meal, camaraderie. It's almost like a reunion when you walk in there. You might see somebody from the peninsula or the south side, and you can uh, share a good time together. Do you... Uh Last year was a bit tough. How did you guys sort of get through that with regards to COVID-19? I know that we're still in some ways still getting back to normal. And as you said, this is a wonderful way to do that. How did you guys get through that? Because the Greek Festival is always such a big ha ha happening in Hampton. Yeah, usually our big event is in the spring, in May, uh, in June. And it's a big Mardi Gras type event. Last year, we did a drive through only, and yeah. then we did a carry-out only. So people are urging us to come back and have some type of normalcy. So last year was totally different, but we've never missed a beat. We've always had the festival, you know, had a great volunteers, the Greek dancers, music, entertainment. It's all all a big package. And tell me specifically, you know, with some of the events with, uh, I know you told me, we were we were talking before the break, he said, don't mention ingredients, which by the way, I'm not a chef either, so mm -hmm. I don't blame you on that one. Yeah. But as far as what folks can expect as far as, you know, the entertainment that's there, what are some things to really look forward to? Well, there's going to be vendors and arts and crafts. You know, it's going to be moderated, of course, it's indoors, but uh, all the great Greek food, the desserts, stuff to go, carry out, that type thing, uh, Greek dancers, music. So there's going to be some nice ambiance mm -hmm. while you're eating your food. And to me, it's all about atmosphere. So this is the place to be for the atmosphere as well. How, give me a little history of this event. Uh, how long has it been around? And uh, you, you've you know worked it enough to know how important it is to the area. Over 54 years. I mean, my mom and dad were involved, the old Greek church downtown in Newport News. We've been in this current building Nathan since uh, 1982. Wow. So it's been a long, long time. It's uh, But it really is a nice event because it's so convenient to both sides of the water. It's right off the interstate, so it's really accessible as well. And is there any way that folks can get involved on social media, just a way to kind of keep up with it to know, you know, any updates that may be going we on? We have a great Facebook page done by one of our board members at the church and also a website, NewportNewsGreekFestival.org. And occasionally we'll put out some tweets too as well, but our Facebook page is really dynamic. He's Greg Bicaveras, and normally, again, he's very, very busy with sports, but uh, you wear many hats, and right. we always we always appreciate it. You seem like you do you ever do you ever sleep? I mean, uh, little little, but we do a lot of commercials here at the station. <laughs> we we love Fox and Wavy both. All right, Greg, thank you so much. Really good to see you. Good my to friend. see you, my friend too. This segment of the Hampton Road Show is sponsored by the Newport News Greek Festival Thursday from 4 p.m. to 9 p.m. Friday and Saturday from 11 a.m. to 9 p.m. on Traverse Road in Newport News. Call 757-596-6151 or visit newportnewsgreekfestival.org. For more information, you can also connect on Facebook.